went to see him a good few times when he was up in Liverpool and you know you'd, 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 you'd be up there for two hours having a chat about various different things there's horse actually that runs here tonight that arrived whole court he had actually rode him in a pint of pint you know and finished second on him and like you'd never ever be stuck for anything to talk about he was he was very very entertaining guy to have a chat with you know and he as as you rightly said he he'd coped with what happened to him really really well you know but it's 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 just desperately sad you know JT transcended all all games and all sports and everything you know it was all over every sort of news news outlet today not just racing but in you know in, in world news everything that and he was obviously very well we know he was a very special person and you know it's great that he um his bubble was seen outside of racing not just amongst you know in our great game it was um seen worldwide and uh, you know some great memories of him it's real sad and and all our thoughts are with his wife and family and it must be awful hard for them so you know but he, he was he was extremely like he the all heart even when he was ill he was he was all heart and like a brave man brave man he was a great man um he was a very tough but fair man uh he was as honest as the day is long uh, if he had an issue with you he told you or an issue with anything he told you he was a wonderful man and uh, to deal with what he's dealt with in the last three and a half years just shows how mentally and physically strong he was and i say it's also a huge um a huge thumbs up to his wife as well i mean what she's had to cope with since that day in Cheltenham and how they've dealt with it um, you know, and his kids, Dylan and Harry and Olivia, and, and all his family. Um, I think if the world had more people like John Thomas and Caroline, it would be a hell of a lot better place. Well said. I mean, they played a lovely tribute to him earlier on in some of the great winners he rode. I thought he was one of the best amateurs I've ever seen him. I'd say you riding against him, he was up there with plenty of the pros you rode against too. So I was with him one day in, 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 in the Bulgers and we were riding a horse. And he is the only man who has ever made a horse do something I couldn't make it do. Um, <laughs> You know, he was a wonderful rider, but um, you remember people for what they did, but I remember him as the man he was. Um, we come and go as jockeys, but he was just a wonderful, wonderful man.